Hi everyone, my name is King Ivy and this is Introduction to Python and in today's lesson we'll be covering dictionaries. So dictionaries are actually a very similar concept to an actual dictionary, physical dictionary, in the sense that there's a value and it's tied to a key. So if I were to open the dictionary and I want to find the definition of speakers, speakers would be the key and then the definition of speakers would be the values. You can also think about similar to contacts on your phone. Uh, say for example, you for whatever reason you have Tom Brady on your on your in your uh, contact list. If you were to do the value Tom Brady, it would re may return you the email, his email address, his phone number, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So let's go ahead and get started. It's a really useful technique and pretty pretty simple to do. So let's start with phone book. So what essentially you do here is in in tuples you would use uh, normal brackets in in a list you would use square brackets in in uh, for dictionaries you use these curly braces. So first thing you need to do is define what your key is. In this case, I'm going to do bro, and then what your value is. In this case, I'm going to just make it one two three four five. I'll just make it one two three which is essentially just their phone number. Not really, obviously it's a fake number, but you get the concept. So I'm gonna do sis, and then I'm gonna do mom. And then you just separate these pairs by commas. Nope. So then if I print phone book, for example, you're gonna see it right there. So if I want, for example, want to look up uh, phone book, and I want to look up what what is my bro's number, and then you'll see here or we'll return your return the bro's number, which is really useful. Another, if you want to update your dictionary, so here you can just go update, and then inside here, do dad for example, and then put in his number zero zero zero, Let's put three zeros, and then we'll print phone book. And then we'll look for dad. There you go. So it gave you return you zeros, obviously, like because uh, these are numbers. Maybe it'll look a little bit better if I put these in quotations. There you go. So we'll return return the value. So you can see how simple and easy it is to build out dictionaries and and to leverage it. And obviously, you can integrate it with other functions and features. Uh, but this is a, a good way of approaching it. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. If you thought this video was helpful, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And I look forward to speaking to you next time. Thank you.